weeks after the election, I got on the scale, I was up 10 pounds, I looked in the mirror, and I had a full beard. And I thought, I'm becoming Al Gore. <laughs> Although I'm up 10 pounds, still I have shaved. How many of you feel that Illinois is running well? 48th in job growth, yet a high-tech state. 36th in education, yet our children commit the most violent crime in the country. We're third in gambling revenues, abortions hit a 10-year high. Cook County hasn't created a job since 1990, and the state of Illinois hasn't created a job since 1997. Bill Brady is going to beat Pat Quinn, because Pat Quinn is extreme. Pat Quinn's extreme on the financial issues, 13 billion dollar budget deficit and 120 billion dollars worth of long-term liabilities and Pat, Pre uh, Pat Quinn is extreme on the social issues. It is extreme to want to, ex to want to eliminate Catholic and Christian hospitals by requiring them to do abortions. Pat Quinn would sign the Freedom of Choice Act. It is extreme to change the definition of marriage. These are Republican platform positions. They're the positions of some of the greatest leaders in DuPage County. Henry Hyde, Peter Roscoe, Kirk Dillard, Jim Ryan, myself, Dan... What's his name again? Prot. <laughs> Dan Cronin. <laughs> These are our principles and values. Bill Brady is leading on those principles and values. I aim to travel the state of Illinois, reminding the people of Illinois that Bill Brady is mainstream and Pat Quinn is extreme. Yeah. On the campaign trail, I used to tell a little joke, and it dealt with my Polish heritage. I want you to know that in Polish, Bill Brady means it means governor. <laughs> and here is my first campaign donation to the Bill Brady campaign for governor. Go Bill!